This video is a part two of a three-part series where we introduce the POSMO passport that are only exclusively available to foreign tourists visiting Japan. Part 1 shows you how and where at the airports to get the POSMO passport as well as updates on the POSMO and SUKA card. If you haven't seen that video, please click for it in the top right or look for it in the description below. In this video, we're going to show you one of the best deals you can get with the POSMO passport an unlimited day pass for as little as $4 USD. Before that, you'll need to learn a bit more about the different train companies and how to use them. There are more than 10 train companies operating in Tokyo and its vicinities. The main one is the Japan Rail East, often referred to as the JR Line. JR's most popular line is the Yamanote Line that runs in a loop around Tokyo and it's green in color. JR is also the company that runs the bullet trains or Shinkansen. See links in the description to learn more. JR Line is symbolized by a square box with two letters that starts with a J. For example, the Yamanote Line is JY, and the Chuo Line is JB, seen here in yellow color. The next big companies are the Tokyo Metro and Toei Lines. They run mostly underground so are referred to as the Subway Lines. Tokyo Metro and Toei are symbolized by a circle with one letter inside. For example, the Oedo line is a circle with an E, and the Ginza line is a circle with a G. The day pass we're going to buy is called the Tokyo Subway Ticket, and it lets you have unlimited travel on all 14 subway lines, the lines with a circle and one letter inside. And you'll be able to get to all the popular locations like Shinjuku, Shibuya, Ginza, Rapongi, Tokyo Station, Weno, Asakusa, Ikebukuro, and more. All for less than $4 USD in a day when you get the Tokyo subway ticket. If you've found this video helpful so far, please hit the like, subscribe and comment and check out the affiliate links in the description. Now, let's try to buy the Tokyo subway ticket at a ticket machine. Here's how. First, you must go to a Tokyo Metro or Toei line station. It won't work at a JR ticket machine. Choose English for the display. Next, choose value ticket. There are eight different kinds of passes you can buy with your POSMO passport, but five of them are exclusively for the POSMO passport or foreign travelers. See how it says POSMO passport at the bottom. You cannot purchase these five with a regular POSMO card, and they are cheaper than the regular passes, so we highly recommend it. If you're only traveling within Tokyo, then the best deal of the five is the Tokyo Subway 72-hour pass for 1,500 yen. Each day's unlimited travel is only 500 yen. If you make more than three trips a day, it would be more than worth it. Click on the Tokyo Subway 72-hour button. Here it explains the ticket is only for international travelers from overseas. Click yes that you have a POSMO passport. Insert the POSMO passport into the top left slot as shown. Let's try if it will work with a regular POSMO card. work with a regular POSMO card. Let's try it now with the POSMO passport. It worked! Now we just need to insert the cash to pay for the ticket. There are three options, use your credit card, use the balance on the IC card, but we'll use cash for this video.
Insert cash into the slots as shown on the screen. We put in 2000 yen so the change is 500 yen. Remember to print the receipt in case there are any issues. Yay! Now we can travel as much as we want for the next 72 hours. Time to see if the card works and what is the display. Recall there was only 90 yen left as a balance on the card. It says the card balance is 90 yen, and the ticket will expire on October 14 at 12.52. You can check against your receipt to verify that it's exactly 72 hours. Yay! It worked! Next, we'll learn how to map our route using Google Maps so we only ride on the Tokyo Metro and Toei lines to make the most of our day passes. See more in the next video. Also, type in the comments POSMO Passport. Thank you for watching.